I, I was, um, <clears throat> I haven't written anything in a very long time, and my dad told me at one time I needed to stop writing everything down and um, just make videos. And I've made a lot of different videos, and uh, normally it's <clears throat> it's when I feel good because I I don't um, you know I I don't feel good a, a majority of the time. But um, <clears throat> I've been really struggling lately, and I felt like I was I was close to something. And you, sometimes you maybe have to hit rock bottom before you um, you climb up a little bit. And I felt rock bottom <laughs> for a very, very long time. But um, I've always believed <clears throat> that, that God can heal me or he's working in my life. And I still do. Um, I was at church this Sunday, this past Sunday with my children, and my daughter was hugging me, and and um, I was I was struggling. I was shaking, and <clears throat> I just didn't feel well. It was a it was a production to get to church, but a lady came up and she laid hands on me and she prayed and she pulled me aside later and um, she knew exactly what to say and she had said that she saw in like a vision that I had felt like I had been defeated but I was but I was above everything and I'd already won. And the devil, and the enemy, he wants you to feel defeated. And um, she said that she saw me just above everything. And that's not the first time somebody has said something. There was a different lady in the church that approached the old ministers and she had asked who I was. She had seen me with the children and she told them you know who's that and they said that's Dan and he's whatever and she she said that she had seen a vision like I had I have risen from the dead and maybe that happened a little bit today um I I am on such a, a roller coaster it's up and down and my problem is in my neck and you can see it's part of the reason why I don't have a shirt on the disformity I have muscles in my neck that aren't even working and he did a new procedure today which is like isometrics and <laughs> I feel as good as I felt in a very 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 long time that may me that mean that um, tomorrow I'll freeze up and you know shake but <clears throat> but I haven't been able to exercise and I'm out here exercising and I, I feel really good and strong and my shoulder has felt like it's popped back into joint and that's what happens when this um, muscle at the base of your C, C1 that on me gets so incredibly hard that it my head goes forward, it's hard for me to breathe. Um, I have some brain fog and I have a tremor and it's it sucks. I mean, I lose coordination. <clears throat> I just have to lay down, move my head side to side on the ground and I have all these neck apparatuses and the heating pads and vibrating things and I do what I have to do to get my neck loose and then um, I get range of motion in my neck and I function normally <laughs> but I mean there's some, some things that happen that, <clears throat> that I, I, I don't understand my ex-wife she 
she's tried to use this disease against me in court for forever. And what she doesn't understand <clears throat> is that if I'm in the water with the children and a shark, I'm swimming at the shark. I'm never going to let anything hurt those kids or do anything to put them in danger. And so just, just quit. But um, I, I love I love my kids more than anything else. And everything I do is for them. Everything I do. And my life is incredibly difficult. But I'm so incredibly blessed as well. And I did something, like I said, that I, um, I said that I would never do. <laughs> and my mom is absolutely going to have a heart attack but um i got a i got a tattoo and <clears throat> i felt like i was close to something and it's um well without further ado uh, let's see if we can see it but it says in latin god has a plan and then it says in the little banner, Psalms 30-2, and I'll let you look that up. <laughs> and then below it, it says, CC, CCT, Omnia Mia. And that's Camden Caden Trip, my everything. And they are my everything. And as long as I breathe, <laughs> I'll fight for those kids. And I'll always do the right thing. So, I love them. But I've always felt God can heal me and um, maybe, or put people in my life for the right doctors. And I still, I still believe that. And maybe he's healed me a little today. If I've learned anything about this disease and how horrible it is, is that it makes you appreciate things and find beauty in moments. People with Parkinson's, I think, appreciate the little things in life much more than we can ever imagine because when you sit over something and you freeze, your body's becoming a prison. And um, I've had some really bad times and some, some good times. And <clears throat> what's um, been my problem lately is I've had I've had trouble with my feet. I um, had surgery on my big toe August of last year, and the swelling has never gone down. And then just in the last couple months, I it's felt like I stepped on a piece of glass in the pad of my foot. And what happened is there's a nerve, there was like a nerve bundle in there, and it swells up and it's moved across the bottom of my feet and into my four other toes and <laughs> it hurts. I mean, you think you know what pain is? <laughs> yeah. But I, um, the chiropractor did this special procedure on me today and, and I, that's how I know everything is related because when my neck feels better, even my foot feels better. And um, I was able to sit in the massage chair and the massage chair has the little rolling balls for your feet. <laughs> and I almost cried, but <clears throat> I put this, this nerve bundle on that and it just needed it. And I mean, yeah, but I've almost got it worked out and I'm standing on my feet <laughs> and I think I can jump rope and um, We'll see <laughs> if it swells up again tomorrow. But like I said, I feel as good as I felt in a very, very, very long time. And um, I am 
thing. I thank God for the healing in my body today. And I, um, I'll, I'll continue to fight. I'll, um, I'll never give up. And God has a plan. I know he does. And I'm just thankful for the things that I have. <laughs>